Hello and welcome <laughs> to Page to Frame, guys. Um, we're going to be doing the quiz today for Mockingjay. I'm Gabby, and this is Tiger. Tiger. We are streaming live on Twitch and on YouTube, so you can follow us on both those social medias to get our live reactions. Uh, and then we do edit after the fact. So Kevin's ready. Ducky's there. I guess we're going to go ahead and go and start today. Who is the leader of District 13? There you go. Yes, I meant President Snail Coin, but someone distracted me. President Coin. I don't know here. Yeah. Gabby wins that one. <laughs> How did no one get it right? No one got it right. <laughs> what is a symbol figurehead for the revolution against the Capitol? You guys get this wrong. I'm going to be a little offended. I was like, this should be easy enough, guys. You can do it. You got it, guys. Mocking Jay. All right. One person got it right. On the quiz. Kev! Kev got it. So these this can be During two different answers. What? During propaganda filming, what building is destroyed in District 8? Hospital. Yeah, it's a, it was a warehouse, but it's in a hospital. So that's why I put multi. No, it was a hospital, though. They, yeah, made they, made it, they makeshifted it into a hospital. So, but it's a big warehouse, if I remember right. No, they were by the warehouses, oh. but it was a hospital. That's why. No, I you're right. It's a makeshift hospital, but they they clar they always state it as a hospital and never a warehouse. It is in the warehouse district, however. Yeah. So. District eight. Yeah, that's why I kind of did both. You mean uh, to tell me Ducky had a 50-50 chance? Yeah, it said multi-select. How does? District 13, no, President Stone is going, going to bomb them. Oh. I know how to spell. Peter tells them. Oh, they both got uh, got it right. <laughs> when does President Snow leave for Katniss after the bombs? After bombing District 13. Oh, this is a question that you had. Yeah, because I had it wrong in the quiz. And I'm like... Did I rem am I remembering this wrong? Because I answered it right and it told me the wrong answer. Yeah, I don't like that this quiz isn't as accurate as it should be. Yeah. All right, who got it right? Somebody answered it right. White roses. Ducky! Ducky caught up. Oh, we're having it. Y'all butting heads now. What did powerful people from the Capitol pay Finnick with? Secrets! And dang it. <laughs> so I guess Kevin didn't get it right. <laughs> Ducky's on fire. Ducky is on a roll. Why does President Snow wear roses? Wait, is that option even there? To cover the smell of blood. Technically, it's to cover... Yeah. Yeah, the bloody sores in his mouth. Yeah, that he's gotten from the poison. Mm-hmm. Uh, for ingesting poison and so many different poisons throughout the years. Because sometimes he had to take the hit. Yep, because he's poisoned all the people in his... Uh, by killing people, he'd drink the same poison over and over. How was PETA tortured in the Capitol? I'm just going to put the symbol. Yeah, but that's how he... Uh, that's crazy, though. People building up poison like that. Building uh, their bodies, building up poison. Uh, well, no, he says poison. that he didn't always... Yeah. Yeah, triangle. He says that not always did he um, ingest it. It were like most of the time he would poison other people. But there yeah. were a few times where it would look suspicious if the other person was poisoned and he wasn't. You could just draw the, the shape too. It's, well, normally I answer them before they generate. So, Oh, I guess that's true. Rebel forces in District 2 need to gain control of the Capitol's military center. The blank. Mm. There you go. Now you can see the shapes. <laughs> Kev, I do not. <laughs> he does not. Oh, need to go? Maybe. He was making fun of Ducky because he said he had to pee. That's fine. Ducky still has time. You got time, Ducky. Oh, wait. He answered. Oh, he, he answered, though. Not. Yes. <laughs> No way I got that right. <laughs> Duck. 
Because it's a hard nut to crack, you know? <laughs> Come on, it was, it was a funny joke. <laughs> Kev, he's beating you now. He came he came up as the underdog. Come on, Kev. Did he, though? From someone who hasn't seen it to someone who has kind of seen it? I know. But he's just guessing, though. He's like, I don't remember. Yeah, but he doesn't even remember it. He guessed it. <laughs> what is the name of Phoenix Love? Su amor. Something with an A. <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> the letter starts with an A. Or the name starts with an A. I was like, I want to flip it to Annie. Somebody guessed it right. I guessed again. <laughs> Do you sure you don't remember it? Well, let's see who got it right. Somebody got it right. Let's see who. Ducky got it right. Kev, I thought you were using Google. Yeah, that's true. Or does it not give them enough time to use Google? It does. I put four minutes on every one of them. But Annie was Phoenix Love. The block is an exam that challenges soldiers' weaknesses. What abil ability of Katniss's did the block challenge? I'm bot. I'm not. I'm not a cheater. <laughs> oh, I thought you were gonna say you were gonna do it though. I still wish they put this part in the movie. So that would have been guess. yeah. I still, you know, I still wish it would have been in the movie. It would have been awesome. Well, you know what's sad is huh? my point of view of it. Talking yesterday, her her overcoming her greatest weakness and then her greatest weakness being what kills half the tributes yeah. for half the people that were with her. I'm just saying. Yeah. She learned her lesson. Yeah. She just did what she wanted to do. Yeah. I stand by that thought, by the way. But I guess that more shows her, too, that um, she was the protagonist, too. So, and time to guess. <laughs> Ability to use archery. That was definitely not her weakness. Uh-uh. I do think it's funny, though. In Hawkeye, or whatever, his, like, little protege is like, look, it's you! And he's like, no, that's Katniss Everdeen. Because <laughs> they're, like, on Times Square or something. They're, like, they're like somewhere where there's people cosplaying, and there was an archer, so that's why she said it. <laughs> And he's like, no, that's Katniss. That's funny. I don't remember that, but you know what? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I do. I like, uh, but yeah, this, I think this would have been awesome because it does show that uh, her weakness, because her that's her most that's her most uh, strongest attribute is her ability to uh, use archery. <laughs> Sillies. Even has it if you look up for her her the 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 just the title of the movie poster. She has a bow and arrow. Um, but yeah, her ability to take orders, she's she's a rebel all the way. So her ability to take orders is not She's rebellious. She's not a rebel. Yeah. Technically she is because she's with the rebellion. Not willingly. Yeah. Okay. Next question. Ducky's in the lead. But Gabby wins anyway. Who didn't pass the training exam? Since they didn't show the training exam in the movies anyway, you'll have to guess this anyway. This was only in the book. <laughs> Joanna. Correct. Um, yeah, Joanna doesn't make it onto uh, to pass the training exam. That's why she doesn't go uh, in the book. She doesn't pass it. And that's why she doesn't go on to the mission uh, with everybody into the capital. And Finnick does with Gail and Katniss. Honestly, if I was coin, I would have still let her go. Yeah, she's ruthless. Come on, she hacks people's heads off with freaking axe. Now, to be fair, I think they would have had to drag her when your favorite scene comes out of the Black U. I do think they would have had to drag her into wherever they were going. Probably. Like, I think Finnick or Gail would have had to literally carry her. Possibly. And she wouldn't have been able to make it in the sewers. Yeah. She would have been one of the, the... She could have been the one they sacrificed. <laughs> Instead of Finnick? Yes! <laughs> She's perfect. No. Go, Ducky. Go, Ducky. 
Ducky got more points. Ducky's going to win this versus battle. Is he, though? Well, Pito? unless Kevin comes back, because we're already on question 14. What does it say, Pito? Pito tries to reconcile his memories using a game called blank. Oh. I should have just looked at the answer question things. The I options. Yeah, I didn't even need. I do love how the book ends, though. You are correct. Real or not real, you love me. <laughs> I quit, Cap. But now you got it. <laughs> He's like, I'm not getting any more. <laughs> you were doing good. You still got in the thousands. Ducky is not freaking guessing all these. He remembers the movies. He's lying to us. Do you really believe that? Um, I don't know. He's not guessing all of these. Which one of these is not a pod? The rebel team faces in the capital. <laughs> okay. Poor Kev. Well, you should watch the movies with us sometime. It's a pretty good movies. Even you know, Steel liked it. Yeah, that's true. Steel did like it. Um, oh, I just he says that. everyone deserved to die most of the time. So, Halster. It's funny when I read this question, I was like, "Oh, I might not know the answer to this." But then uh, I saw the, the options, and I was like, "Oh no, it's right there in bold letters." I got it wrong. <laughs> To well, be yeah. fair, if you don't know Hunger Games, you don't know what a mutt is. Yeah, that is true. Because that's probably the only one I would definitely never not, definitely not choose for this type of question in regards to Hunger Games. Well, the only other logical thing you could think of, though, too, what could you really fit a hailstorm inside a pod, though? <laughs> yeah, they freaking fit that tidal wave in one. Not in a pod. They had those like in the streets, though. No, that's a pod. All of those are meant to be pods, though. That was like in an arena. Yes, but at the Capitol, they have all the pods. No, I'm talking about the oil wave that that Peter went crazy on. Yeah. And they all ran away. That was in a pod. They activated a pod, and that's what activated that wave of oil which is literally what it says oil subs whatever yeah the toxic oily substance yes that yeah that was in a pod that was a but pod they, like sealed off an area for that but it was a pod that, got that makes sense that's like liquid stuff you can drop but like a hail storm there uh, it, you theoretically could i'm I just did. saying like half the things that were activated by pods Hailstorm isn't that out of the question. I guess. Eh. Ducky's on fire. Uh, trying to get to the capital, the group hides in the fur shop of a citizen named Blank. Those are such cute emotes. I misspelled the name. Wow. I told you we could just use the shape. I did both. Tigerous. Somebody gonna write. They are absolutely adorable. I love them. I bet you was Ducky. I, I bet you he remembers. No! Oh, <laughs> Ducky got it wrong and Kev got it right. Let's go! <laughs> Kev Let's came go. back from the depths. <laughs> I literally guess because you're here. Gail gives PETA a blank in case PETA is recaptured during their mission in the city circle. City oh. circle, yeah. Gail gives PETA a blank in case PETA is recaptured during their mission to the city circle. Done. <laughs> you literally guessed because my name is Tiger. <laughs> that works. Well, it worked for you. There you go. Got your points. It's funny. I thought that too. I was like, would you give a hint as to... I was wearing this yesterday though too, to be honest. Because I was cold yesterday, so I wore this. It's a whole Tigger onesie. Emily was so excited I was wearing this yesterday. She's like, my Tiger's oh, yeah, a Tigger. Yeah. Nightlock pill. Yep, nightlock pill. Yep. And they die super quick. Oh, Kev got it again. Woo! Now I'm guessing. You said you've been guessing the whole time. See, you were right. He remembered. Yeah, see, I told you. What flower does PETA plant around Katniss's home in District 12? 
Now I need to get a, a duck outfit. Do it. Get a duck onesie, please. I will be so entertained. This one's so sad. This one is sad. I could have add more questions too. You could. Well, that's what I I was saying. I eventually want yes, Primrose, correct? Um, I want us to like add questions and have people come up with questions and. I asked you before if you wanted me to come up with questions. You didn't tell me yes or no. That's true. Um, I was going to ask you if you want to take a quiz. Um, there's Do another you quiz. A clown one? <laughs> Why a clown one? I was going to ask if you wanted uh, to do another quiz from another YouTuber where they made it out of their mind, like out of their heads. Uh, they're called the Super Carlin Brothers, one of my favorite YouTubers. Yeah. And they have a super hard mocking uh, Hunger Games quiz. Okay. So if you want to, we could do that tomorrow. Okay. Because that's what I look like to my exes, apparently. <laughs> Jesus. Well, I would just for that. I'm going to get one when I get paid. Yes. I'm going to be so excited if you get a ducky, ducky onesie. I'm going to be super excited. What item does Katniss find in her home in Victor's village after District 12 is destroyed? Uh, this one I'm actually guessing at. I'm doing deductive reasoning. No one guessed it. Did you I, guess it? I, yep, yeah, you sure did. <laughs> yeah, uh, she finds, remember she finds the white rose in the vase upstairs? No, yeah, I was like, out of deductive reasoning... Very positive. They're talking about the white rose. Yep. 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 <laughs> Kev's like, no. <laughs> you got four out of 18, Kev. And Ducky got nine. <laughs> Gabby's over here. She's like, I got every one of them. How about that? <laughs> no, like I read the books. Yeah. <laughs> I'm second. I'll take it. <laughs> That's true. Well, one out of, uh, to, you know, that works. <laughs> and then uh, below this link and below all of our videos will be our, uh, once we post the non-live version, I guess, to YouTube, we will have our Amazon affiliate links for both the novels and the movies. So you guys, if you guys want to see that stuff on your own, you are more than welcome to as well and have that option all right guys talk to you guys later have a good night have a good week thank you for tuning in